Hey everyone, in this video we're going to be talking about how to install OpenCV in Visual Studio Code on Windows 11. If you do not have Visual Studio Code installed yet on your PC, click the video in the top right hand corner of your screen now or in the description down below to quickly install Visual Studio Code on Windows 11. So let's get right into this tutorial. Let's begin by opening up Visual Studio Code by heading to our search bar and right clicking it. And I'm going to run it as an admin so there's no potential permission errors pop up later. Let's go to our desktop and create a brand new folder that we will use for our OpenCV project. So I'm just going to call it such. Now, inside Visual Studio Code, let's open up our OpenCV project folder. Now, we need a Python file to import OpenCV into, right? So let's create a new file through this button here and name it main.py. The .py indicates that we are creating a Python file. Let's go up to view and open up our terminal window. As you can see, we are indeed inside our newly created folder on our desktop based on this directory here. So in order to import libraries into our folder, we should create a Python virtual environment. To accomplish this, let's head down to our terminal and type Python 3.10, or whatever version of Python you are working with, dash M V E N V study session. You can replace study session here with whatever you wish to call your virtual environment though. Now, if we go back to our file explorer on Visual Studio Code, you can see our virtual environment is now here. Also, make sure that you are using the correct interpreter after creating your virtual environment, like so. Let's first activate our virtual environment so that our terminal knows we only want to work within that environment. So we need to find and use this activate file here through our terminal. That was created with our virtual environment. So to get there from our OpenCV folder, we enter study session, scripts, and then activate and be sure you are using forward slashes when moving between folders. Now, you can see we are working within our virtual environment because of these parentheses names here on the left of our terminal line. To upgrade pip, let's type pip3 install dash dash upgrade pip, and we will install the latest version of pip. Now, to install OpenCV to our virtual environment, let's type pip install OpenCV dash python, and you should see a download begin like so. To validate that OpenCV is now installed correctly, let's write the following simple code that will print out the version of OpenCV that we just downloaded to prove our library is downloaded correctly. And as you can see, it is. Thank you for checking out this video and I hope it helped your understanding of how to install OpenCV in Visual Studio Code on Windows 11. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, and consider checking out our YouTube memberships by clicking that join button down below. However, if you have any comments, questions, or concerns about the information I provided in this video, please leave a comment down below and I will do my best to address your concerns.